Jude 1 21. He said, Keep yourselves in the love of who? Of God. Looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ unto. Keep yourself where? In the love of God. Who is the love of God? Where will you keep yourself? Keep yourself, paraphrasing, in Jesus. Because Jesus is the love of God translated in the flesh. Are we together? Paraphrasing verse 22, I say, keep yourself now in Jesus. Looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ unto eternal life. That is, you must keep yourself in Jesus. While you are in Jesus, he said, looking for where? For mercy. There is a mercy that is kept in Jesus. Only those that are in Jesus can access that mercy. Are we together? The place of mercy to eternal life is hidden in Jesus. And to get it in Jesus, you must be stayed in Jesus. And while you are in him, you will search for that mercy unto where? Eternal life. Walk out your salvation with what? With fear and trembling. That means if you don't search for the mercy, it will be in Jesus. You will die and still go to hell. That is why the scripture says, not all that calls me Lord, Lord, will enter into where? The kingdom of God. It is only them that search for the mercy. There is a mercy that leads to eternal life. It's located in Jesus. That you are around Jesus is not a qualification to eternal life. If it is, then I will tell you that Judas Iscariot will have made it to heaven. That those men that were around Jesus that later on said crucify him wouldn't have said crucify him because they are around the owner or the hidden place of the mercy city. There is a mercy seat that is hidden in Jesus. To internal life we require mercy. The place of mercy is the place of eternal life. But to get that mercy, as simple as it looks, as very, very, very flexible mercy, it's just mercy. We can go and say, God have mercy, have mercy. As simple as we can translate or we can pronounce it, it's not as simple as we get it. It is looked for. That is what Apostle Jude said. He said, looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ unto eternal life. You will enter into Jesus and you start looking for where is his mercy. There are different kinds of mercy located in the life called Jesus. You must look for the one that is able to save you into eternal life. If not, there are different mercies in Christ Jesus. Are we together? Is it too deep? No. There are mercies, so many mercies. In God. I told us there are so many, but we're going to take only two. So when you enter into Jesus, you start looking for the one specific that you are there for. You can be in Jesus. There are, oh, let me, Holy Spirit, grant me an illustration. Praise the Lord. In a fridge, in a fridge that is well loaded, amen, it has different fruits, mango, juice, Goruba, all that, hallelujah. Coca-Cola, Pepsi, all that, hallelujah. You are looking for a juice to drink or juice or you are just looking for a liquid to take. You want the one that will quench your thirst. When you go to fridge, you don't go and look for Coca-Cola. It doesn't quench thirst. Are we together? If you go, though everything there is liquid, when you open the fridge, you will locate the one that is your immediate need, which is to quench your what? Your taste. You now look for ordinary H2O. Water. I mean, you now drink and you quench your test. And thereafter, when your test is quenched, you can now say, oh, no, I just want to enjoy myself. Hallelujah. Let me look. Is it fruit juice? Is it mango? Is it Pepsi, then you now look for the another preference of what your heart now desire at that time. You now pick and drink. This is what I'm saying by the Spirit that in Christ there are different mercies 
they are all liquid as I said masses there is the liquid in that fridge in God so when you are coming to God your desire is to quench your debt which is your taste now as I give the illustration, you want to quench the test you have. Now, you don't go to mango and take. If mango symbolizes the place of healing, so you can go and access healing and you'll be healed, but your salvation is not healed. Are you together with me? So you will not seek for the mercy of eternal life, the water of life. You will not take it and quench first. Kill the test. Then you will not go for other things. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and every other thing shall be added unto you. Matthew 6, 33. This is what you do when you enter into Jesus. Said Jude, the apostle.